All right, so the first mod we're gonna be looking at is going to be the Cyclops Auto Zapper mod. I believe that's what it's called. So the Cyclops Auto Zapper mod adds two, two new upgrades to your Cyclops that you'll be able to craft in the Cyclops Fabricator. And I clicked on the wrong one. So you click on the more Cyclops upgrade section. And then right here, you'll be able to find the Cyclops Auto Defense System Mark I and then you'll find the auto parasite remover so for both of those modules to actually work you will need to have a cmoth in your cyclops just a little a little unique i would say you need that you need a cmoth and you also need the cmoth you'll need a cmoth with the perimeter defense module equipped on it to actually be able to use the mark one auto defense and the parasite remover so let's go on and put that in there it's a pretty unique way of having like a unique requirement i'd say okay and now it says cmoth connected defense system charge yada 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 and get the shield generator so when we put it in here right now it's gonna say shield not connected because the shield generator isn't in there but once we put it in there now the shield's connected and the defense system what did i just say the defense system is now charged so now we can use both of those upgrades so let's spawn in some creatures i actually don't know how to use the actual module so let's find out okay now they're aggressive oh okay oh that's neat and it's also super convenient so you can just swim so it automatically Oh, it's still going. Okay. Okay, my fault. Uh, so essentially, whenever there's a hostile creature that sort of aggroes like this one, so it's going to go off again. Cause he's, yeah, because he's red. Whenever a hostile creature is aggressive and it's coming towards you, and you have that auto defense installed, it'll automatically set off the perimeter defense like a couple of second intervals until that creature gets far enough away from you or until it you know like loses aggro like this crab squid and it's gonna go off again because it's coming after me yeah let's test out the um the other one okay y'all latch on so i can see this i want to see this upgrade in action oh swim away okay no he's coming he's coming he's not automatically posted the cyclops shield at low power to detach parasites it says at low power how did you get in here what the nothing is just Nothing's happening really in particular. I mean, you can activate the shield, the Cyclops shield generator to knock them off your Cyclops instantly, but like the, it does that in the base game. So I'm not sure, maybe I'm doing something wrong or maybe I'm not, I'm not 100% sure. If y'all know how that upgrade works, maybe y'all like have the mod already or something. But if y'all know how that upgrade works, feel free to explain it to me in the comments. Cause I don't know what the trick just happened. But I do know that I really like that first upgrade though. The one that uh, automatically sets off the Seamoth and whatnot. And it doesn't drain any energy out of the Seamoth. Now you can upgrade that mo that upgrade and get the auto defense system mark two, which will basically get rid of the whole fact that you have to put the Seamoth in there and it'll just allow you to, it'll allow you to use the Cyclops on its own. It'll basically give the Cyclops its own thing. Yeah, see, and now we don't need the seam off in there for it to actually work. The auto zapper mod done. Let's go on to our next mod. The second mod that I wanted to go over is going to be the Cyclops Sonar Enhancement mod. I believe that's what it's called, but it does make your life a little more convenient. So when you use your Cyclops, your Sonar and your Cyclops, without the mod, it'll just like highlight the area like, you know, it regularly would. So it'll just make everything like red and whatnot, make stuff easier to see. But with the Sonar Enhancement mod enabled, when you activate your Sonar, it's going to show you a map of the terrain that you're in, or terrain that you're in slash around, and which is really cool because it'll make the area a little easier to navigate through. You know, you'll know, especially if it's in like a dark area, you'll know what's around you in terms of as far as the geography of the land goes, you know. My only wish is that I wish you could just turn this to like use it without the sonar having to be on. I feel like that'd be even cooler and just for convenience, but you know, it's still, it's still cool nonetheless. But yeah, sonar enhancement, super cool little mod. All right, and the last mod we got is going to be the Altera turret mod, a turret designed for base protection. What it says it does and exactly what you would think a turret would do. So when you put it down, I believe it's going to start shooting at any hostile creatures that sort of come near you. All right, let's spawn in, spawn crabs, win. Sir, what y'all doing against third? Damage, get him, get him, yep. Yep, lay him out. Yeah, that's what like to be. Oh, yeah. Oh, the turret defense. Oh, yeah. You see, now this, this 100% the mod that I would have on my game. Yep, yep, getting, getting slipped up there. Yep. And they got some bone sharks in the crossfire. Boom. Did they get them all? Dang. Because they laid them out quick, didn't they? Turn the damage off. Let's head outside. See what, see what. Yep, yeah, they got him. Oh, yeah, they got him. I, yep, then, then. Oh, oh. They see him some more. I ain't seeing him. Yep, dead. They got a bone shark in the crossfire. He also dead. 
Another one down, yep. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have our base in the mountains. We have our Altera turrets set up. So now we're gonna spawn in some Reapers. They're already shooting. All right, well, we know they shoot at the Reapers, but let's see how fast they can take some down. Hey, you can only the bomb here, all right, spawn the Reaper, Leviathan. These things are loud as I don't know what. Let's spawn about 30 of them. Oh, yeah. 30 Reapers in the same environment. Turn the damage on. Turrets, go to work. Light them up. Nope, that's one Reaper. Yep, one Reaper just bit the dust. They're still firing. It looks like freaking AA gunfire out here. And Reapers all running away. <laughs> one got clapped. Is that gonna be another? Is that gonna be a second one? Nope, they're focusing fire on that one. He might, he might be next. Oh, no, he running away. Yeah, he knew it was good. It appears the turrets do not hurt the Cyclops, so that's good. Nope, that Reaper just died. Yep, they another Reaper down. Another Reaper down. All right, two Reapers, three Reapers in total got collapsed during this experiment. That is. All right, y'all, that's about all I had for y'all. I wanted to test these mods out, especially this Altera turret model, because I I got onto Nexus. I saw this mod, and I was like, yo, this jump looks clean as a... No, as a, as a mod, it looked kind of clean. So I had, to, I had to test it out. I had to test it out. This mod did not disappoint. I'm going to leave the link to all the mods that I showed in this video in the description, so y'all can go check these mods out yourselves, especially this one, because I, I really like this one. This one's awesome. But yeah, that is about all I have for y'all. I hope y'all enjoyed, and I will see y'all in the next one. Peace.